Hello everyone, welcome to the video tutorial of Xespress Mag. I'm Ellie from Xespress Team. Well, in this video, I will include uh, the footer setting that you can do with uh, this theme. So this is the demo site of Xespress Mag, and in this video, I'll cover how you can set this footer area. So let's go to your WordPress dashboard. Here, click on Appearance and then go to Theme option. Now the third option that you get is footer under which you can uh, do some of the settings on do almost all of the settings on the footer so click on the first option that is footer setting here as you can see you have the option to hide or show the footer widget area so you can choose the number of columns you want on the footer uh, widget area so let us select three column widget area save our option and the contents that you can put there is from the widgets so for that let's go to appearance and then click on widget now these are the available widgets that we had provided you with the xespress mag and these are the four areas of footer so let's fill them up with a widget you can put there any widget as you want I'm putting calendar then write the title and save it now in footer 2 I'm keeping this text widget and write some description about this theme I have it ready here And then save it now for the third footer I'll be putting this random post widget on footer 3 I'm keeping the title now after all your uh, setting is uh, saved uh, that means the widget are saved here with footer 1 2 and 3 let's go to the front end of the website and see how that appears on the home page so this is the website we are working on and this is the footer area that comes with three widget as you can see it has got three columns that we selected so this is all about this area setting now let, uh, let me show you the configuration to this area so let's go back to the uh, WordPress and go to theme option again on the footer there is sub footer setting <coughs> now here is the option that is sub footer option copyright text copyright option and footer menu well if you select yes then you can show the menu on the footer and you can choose from here either you want to show primary menu or secondary menu let me uh, select one of the menu that is secondary menu so if you check it yes then this will show well if you uh, select yes here that is the copyright option you can write the copyright text that is I have written Xespress mag right now and save your option now let's go back to the front end of the website and see what change that will make. You can see the menu here and the copyright. Well then if you select this no and even don't show the copyright then your footer area on the home page will look something like this. That is without the menu and without any copyright text. So in this way, uh, this is how you can configure your uh, footer setting. 
And I hope this video is helpful to you. If you have any confusion, please refer to our online documentation on our website. Thank you very much.